It is of interest to the person who is speaking to acquire knowledge regarding the projected price of XRP throughout the present market cycle, as well as the potential outcomes that are feasible to think may materialize in the real world. In their statement, they make reference to an article that was published not so long ago by a chart analyst who analyzed the potential price of XRP. The information presented in this article is derived on actual price shifts that have taken place in the past. The individual who is speaking, on the other hand, does not have any prior experience working in the financial field and does not offer any advice regarding financial matters. They are an enthusiast who takes joy in generating videos on YouTube about a variety of crypto-related topics for their own fun. The prices that are being discussed during this market cycle are in the double digits, and the speaker does not provide any estimates on the values that are expected to occur. The speaker is not providing any financial advice, nor does the speaker themselves provide any financial advice during the presentation. More information regarding the market cycle is going to be made available by them in a short period of time. An examination of the Bitcoin asset class was presented in a film that was made available not too long ago. It is vital for market cycles, including the stock market, to have sufficient liquidity, and it is essential for investors to make investments in a variety of assets, including the wonderful seven small cap coins and the Russell 2000. Both of these things are essential. Real Paul, who was a former executive at Goldman Sachs and is now the CEO of Real Vision, has been an essential figure in the process of determining the liquidity cycles that are the primary motivating factor behind the Bitcoin market. According to Paul's chart, Bitcoin is potentially on the verge of experiencing tremendous breakout rallies as a consequence of one key trigger, which is the expanding liquidity on a global scale as a result of this association, which is strong. This association is a significant indicator of the value of Bitcoin. Every time there is an increase in liquidity, there is a need to allocate money to a specific location. It has been determined that there is a correlation between the fact that a particular amount of the additional liquidity has been assigned to Bitcoin in particular and the fact that this allocation has been made. The picture that Paul designed shows the price of Bitcoin up to the point in time when he uploaded it in September 2024. Additionally, the graphic also shows the global M2 in billions of islands. While the M2 market is quite liquid, it has a lead time of 10 years. Global liquidity reflects some of the most liquid assets, while the M2 market is quite liquid. Quite a high correlation exists between this relationship and the time period that goes all the way back to the end of the year 2023. This association is linked to the time frame described above. On the other hand, this does not necessarily suggest that Bitcoin will reach $90,000 in the near future. The M2 metric indicates that the connection between Bitcoin and the total quantity of money in circulation around the world, which is the most valuable digital asset in terms of market capitalization, appears to be getting ready for a large breakout. A macroeconomic expert at Real Vision named Julian Bay is also of the opinion that the current macroeconomic circumstances are beginning to pump more liquidity into the markets. This is generally seen to be favorable for risk on assets like as Bitcoin. Bay is of the belief that this is happening. The Federal Reserve's decision to lower interest rates by 50 basis points should result in an increase in liquidity and a fall in the cost of capital. This should be the case as a consequence of the decision. If there is a reduction in the risk that is involved with taking out loans, then individuals and businesses will be more eager to do so, which will in turn promote economic activity. When the interest rate is lower, people are more likely to participate in the activities that are being mentioned since they are considered more appealing. Taking this into consideration makes complete sense and has the ability to encourage this expansion. To summarize, liquidity is a crucial factor that constitutes the driving force behind the Bitcoin market. Considering that investors are required to make investments in a variety of assets, including Bitcoin, in order to ensure that they are in a comfortable position for the future, investors are required to hold Bitcoin. A second factor that has contributed to the acceleration of this trend is the decision that the Federal Reserve made to cut interest rates by 50 basis points. Additionally, the Federal Reserve has recently made modifications to its interest rates which have also contributed to the acceleration of this trend. In order to take advantage of the benefits of increased liquidity and the prospect of profiting from the ongoing expansion of the cryptocurrency market, it is necessary to acquire these assets. One cannot be absolutely certain that the recent reductions in interest rates implemented by the Federal Reserve have been damaging to the economy. In recent years, there have been a number of different environments such as the environment of boom and bust, the environment of the global financial crisis, and the environment of the pandemic setting. However, there have been instances in which an effort to lower interest rates has been successful and the economy has continued to operate normally despite the reduction in interest rates. Julian Bid, a macro expert, highlighted the fact that liquidity is once again on the rise. Bitcoin, which is particularly sensitive to changes in liquidity circumstances, has the potential to move explosively as more cash enters the system. An important liquidity wave is currently on the horizon, and when it arrives, Bitcoin appears to be in a position to make a major push higher in the fourth quarter. This is because the wave is expected to arrive. Constitutes the most favorable period for the stock market, particularly for the SP500, throughout the current quarter. Greg Crypto, a chart analyst, displays a chart of the cryptocurrency XRP. 
The picture illustrates the percentage rises that have occurred for genuine XRP pumps since the beginning of 2014 and makes a prediction on the price of XRP in the event that significant gains occur once more during the current cycle. To summarize, the current state of the economy is not nearly as catastrophic as was previously imagined, and the ability to exercise patience and perseverance is of the utmost importance. As a result of this, the speaker investigates the multiplier effect that cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin experience from one cycle to the next. Additionally, the speaker discusses the implications of this phenomenon. The returns that are often lower are those that move from the bottom of the cycle to the top of the cycle. Because the rise in the amount of money and everything requires the flow of even more money to double, treble, or quadruple, this means that there will not be an increase from one cycle to the next, because it has not hit a new all-time high in almost seven decades. This is the reason why this is the case. The situation that XRP is in is truly one of a kind. However, when compared to the previous cycle which took place only a few years earlier in 2021, the multiplier reached its greatest point of $2. T. His was the case when compared to the previous cycle. Despite the fact that it may not have set a new all-time high, the speaker is of the opinion that the basic notion is accurate. After a predetermined length of time has elapsed, the likelihood of collecting money that can completely transform one's life and extremely high multipliers becomes less likely. However, before going through what he has said, the speaker will first present some general thoughts and perspectives for the audience to take into consideration. It is his opinion that if XRP is a viable asset over the long term and makes sense, it has the ability to see a gain of 5,000 in a single pump by utilizing historical precedent. He does not make any predictions regarding the price of XRP, but he does believe that it has the capacity to see such a gain. The historical data that he offers serves to highlight this concept. In light of previous pumping, the speaker analyses and outlines five distinct potential paths that XRP could go in the future. A 932 pump, which would raise XRP to $3, is represented by the color white at this time. The color yellow is equivalent to $15.63 per pump, which will result in the price of XRP reaching $485. There will be a 235 pump, which will bring XRP to $622. The color red signifies this pump. In order to prevent any unexpected bias that may be produced by candle formations and to guarantee that the XRP army continues to be stable, the color green signifies 9,468 per megapump. This will bring the price of XRP to $27. A measurement that is half of the wick is utilized by the speaker. At the very least, the black horse is ready to sell at least 10 times, 15 times, 25 times, or even 94 times. When it comes to selling tiny quantities at each significant objective, the speaker chooses each and every one of them. Additionally, the speaker mentions that if XRP is able to make sense in terms of preserving its sustainability over the long run, it has the potential to experience a massive spike that might result in profits that are hundreds of percentage points higher than they would have been otherwise. In spite of this, he does not express the belief that he believes that this is the situation with DeCycle. As the presentation comes to a close, the speaker emphasizes the value of having a firm knowledge of historical facts, as well as the possibility of big gains in cryptocurrencies. They illustrate the many opportunities that are available as well as the potential earnings that are linked with them. These five various color scenarios are utilized by them. Through the utilization of historical data and the avoidance of bias caused by candle formations, the objective of the speaker is to provide assistance to investors in preserving their calm and avoiding making the same mistakes that they did during the previous cycle. He feels that XRP has reached its highest degree of readiness since the previous massive pump, which took place in 2017. When they first started dealing with cryptocurrencies, they were unskilled with them and had a little number of assets. On the other hand, they now have more time by which to acquire. The individual who is speaking is of the opinion that the possibilities for what is to come are more exciting than they have ever been, and that it is simply a matter of time to see what, in the end, takes place. They warn that they are not a financial counselor and advise against buying or selling anything based on their advice because it would be a poor idea until the next time they meet. They also advise against making any purchases or sales based on their advice.